19 genetically modified organisms you didn't know about. 18. Featherless Chicken Israeli scientists have created this strange animal, a chicken without any feathers. The weird-looking animal is supposedly much cheaper to raise, more environmentally friendly, and doesn't require any feather plucking which, in general, saves resources. This naked chicken can literally go straight from farm to fridge without much work. While this seems like a great idea, there are still some hurdles to cross, such as the fact that, without feathers, chickens cannot protect themselves from harsh weather and parasites. 17. Glittering Gold Seahorses Vietnam-based scientists have created a breed of seahorse that is literally worth its weight in gold. Scientists took the fluorescent gene from a jellyfish and inserted it into a tiny grain of gold, which was then injected into the eggs of a seahorse. This glittering gene was absorbed into the cells of the seahorse, and they grew into glittery seahorses that shine in the light. While it seems like a lucrative venture to sell glittery pet fish, the scientists were testing out a technique to replace negative genes with good genes in humans and livestock. 16. Singing Mouse While we usually genetically modify animals and conduct experiments with a direct purpose, the Evolved Mouse Project doesn't really do that. Instead, they add sort of random genes to mice, let them breed, and see what happens. That's how, after mixing mice genes with bird genes, we got singing mice. Baby mice were found inherently to know how to sing from a young age. When other non-genetically modified mice grew up around the singing mice, they actually learned how to make similar sing-song chirpy noises themselves. 15. Glowfish There is a pet fish whose DNA is patented and trademarked, and that fish is the glowfish. They are genetically modified zebra danio fish that were crossed with the fluorescent proteins of a jellyfish to create fun fish that glow different neon colors. Other glowfish were created by splicing the zebra danio with sea coral and other jellyfish genes. You can own your very own GMO fish in most parts of the United States, except for California. 14. Spare Part Pigs It's pretty common now to use the heart valves from pigs to transplant into human hearts. But now, we can develop pigs that we could take the entire organs from for human transplants. These pigs are used for spare parts and have been designed so that their hearts, livers, kidneys, pancreases, and other organs can be taken whole to be put into humans without our body's immune system rejecting it. 13. Fast Growing Salmon when it comes to sustainable food sources, we usually look towards domesticated animals and plants that we can farm and breed. Salmon is sometimes farmed, but they take a little while to reach maturity. That is, until Aqua Bounty genetically modified the Atlantic salmon with Chinook salmon and a bottom-dwelling eelfish to create a salmon that grows twice as fast and twice as big. 12. Male Tilapia Over the last few years, we have genetically modified tilapia to help them mature faster and grow larger with fewer resources. This would be taken a step further with making sure that more male tilapias are born than female ones. Female tilapia breed by holding eggs in their mouth. During this time, they won't eat anything, which means they end up being smaller. Tilapia farmers prefer bigger fish and thus would rather have more male tilapia than female ones in their farms. 11. Sudden Death Mosquitoes Mosquitoes are one of the biggest proliferators of malaria, resulting in a million deaths and infecting more than 300 million people every year. Scientists began engineering special mosquitoes to combat this by creating mosquitoes that resist the parasite that passes malaria, effectively killing off all mosquitoes. Scientists began engineering special mosquitoes to combat this by creating mosquitoes that resist the parasite that passes malaria and other mosquitoes who would die before reaching sexual maturity, effectively killing off all mosquitoes. The resistant mosquitoes, however, wouldn't be able to resist quickly evolving parasites, and the sudden death ones would risk affecting the entire ecosystem that relies on eating mosquitoes. So, these GMOs are restrained to the labs they were made in. 10. Glow-in-the-dark cats. Cats are made vulnerable to a virus that is closely related to HIV called feline immunodeficiency virus. It's a virus that affects feral cats pretty frequently, and there are half a billion cats in the world. In 2011, Japanese and US-based scientists inserted a gene into cats to help them resist feline AIDS, and to make sure that gene was easily visible to the scientists. In 2011, 
Japanese and U.S.-based scientists inserted a gene into cats to help them resist feline AIDS. And to make sure the gene was easily visible to the scientists, they added a gene that made the cats glow in the dark. So, there are a bunch of super mutant cats out there with disease immunities and the ability to emit a green glow from their skin. 9. The ripest and juiciest strawberries you got from the supermarket might contain the genetic traces of a fish. Scientists have been experimenting with combining strawberries with the antifreeze genes that are found in cold water fish like arctic char and sea flounders, which help the strawberries resist freezing and dying in bad weather. Luckily, it doesn't create a weird, fishy-tasting strawberry. 8. Glow-in-the-dark rabbit Most genetically modified organisms have a specific purpose in mind or a greater goal that usually justifies messing with something's DNA spread. Most genetically modified organisms have a scientific purpose in mind or a greater goal that usually justifies messing with something's DNA spread. However, Edward Keck used genetic engineering for creating works of art rather than for scientific research. His most notorious work was the glow-in-the-dark rabbit named Alba. It sparked a debate about animal rights, but Alba died before anything was resolved. 7. Goats spliced with spiders When you think of genetically splicing something with a spider, you usually think of superheroes with spider-themed superpowers. However, in real life, you can find animals that have been genetically combined with spiders, goats. Spider silk is flexible and strong, and some even want to try and produce it on a larger scale so we can use it to make things like parachute cords. One lab has spliced spider genes with a goat, so that these flexible and strong spider silk genes would be replicated in their milk. This silk milk is also able to create biosteel, a strong web-like material. 6. Golden Rice Rice is a major staple food in many parts of the world, partly because it's cheap and partly because it helps you feel full even when you don't have much to eat. However, the normal white rice isn't very healthy for you. That is why scientists are working on golden rice, rice that was spliced with vegetables like squash and carrots that not only create the golden color, but also include beta-carotene, which is more nutrient-dense and could help prevent blindness in children who eat it. 5. Ear Mouse The most notorious genetically modified animal might be the ear mouse, or the Vacanti mouse, which was created in 1995 by scientists in Massachusetts. The scientists wanted to prove that cartilage structures could be grown on other living creatures before being removed and transplanted into humans who need it. However, this mouse would quickly become famous or infamous as it went on to the Jay Leno show and then used as a mascot by animal rights groups who are opposed to genetic modifications. 4. Scorpion Cabbage The Androctinus australis is one of the most dangerous scorpions in the world with a venom that can cause tissue damage and death. So, of course, we combine the genes from this scorpion with cabbage intended for human consumption. The gene of the scorpion's venom changed when it was spliced with the cabbage. The venom is now only poison to insects, which spasm and die when they try to eat the crop. The same poison is supposedly completely harmless to humans, making it the perfect crop. 3. Anti-Cancer Purple Tomatoes Researchers have also created a tomato that is not only more flavorful, but would also help prevent cancer. The researchers spliced tomatoes with a snapdragon flower to create a deep purple tomato that almost looks like a blackberry. These super tomatoes contain potent antioxidants and inhibit the growth of cancer cells, ease the symptoms of diabetes, and even relieve the pains of growing old. You might just see purple tomatoes on your pizza someday soon. 2. Chinese Dog Pig This image went around the internet with a bunch of people thinking it was some sort of failed chimera of a pig and a dog because of its pink skin and strange tufts of hair. While it was not an animal that was genetically engineered in a lab, it is an animal that has been genetically engineered over generations. This dog, in particular, is the hairless Chinese crested dog, an expensive and rare breed of dog that is highly sought after by some people, even though the winner of the annual World's Ugliest Dog Contest is usually a Chinese crested. 1. Less flatulent cows. You might have heard that cows produce an excess of methane, which contributes to the dangerous greenhouse effect. It's hard to make cows stop producing methane since they're some of the most populous domestic livestock in the world and that it's a natural part of their digestive progress. Until we genetically modified cattle to produce 25% less of the bacterium in their digestive tract that creates methane gas. Basically, we made cows fart less.